Hey, how's it going guys? Today we're going to be talking about why nobody plays this amazing server called Galaxite. Yeah, anyways, let's get started. So Galaxite is more of a newer server. We saw it become a featured server a little while ago. It might have been like around when the Nether update came out or something like that. And there were a lot of people on the Galaxite when it first came out. Just kind of like how a lot of people were on Pixel Paradise when it came out because they wanted to see how it was. But if we look at Par Pixel Paradise right now, there's not a lot of people on Pixel Paradise. But yeah, let's look at Galaxite. There are less than a thousand players on right now. So you can see we already have that custom logo that the hive has i feel like they're doing a pretty good job of keeping their theme sort of like futuristic maybe like on a completely different planet if you look around this is some high quality stuff they have these animated games and these games are super fun i sometimes will log on and i'll play chronos i don't think i've ever played that before that looks like fun but these guys make so many new games and they're all completely original and super fun so why are there less than a thousand people on compared to the high of several thousand players. If this will load, I'll try to show you. 9,301. I'm on kind of at like a bad time, so this might actually be like a thousand in a little bit. So why don't people go into Galaxite as much as like say the Hive or Qcraft? Well, one reason might be is that it's too modded. Like, yeah, let's take a little look at this. We have all of these things. They all have animation. They're all trying to catch your attention like this one. And like, honestly, it's very overwhelming when you first join the server. You're like, what is happening? What do I do? I've noticed that they didn't have this before originally. This was like, this is a completely new thing. And I can tell they're trying to make a fair amount of money. There's this like huge title up here. And honestly, they've just been working on stuff like this that they don't necessarily need on their server. So yeah, let's go ahead and take a look at this game. We do have these little advertisements in these little lobbies, which I feel like it's kind of a cash grab. I feel like they're trying to like uh, pull as much money as they can out of the players. There's like all of this different stuff you can buy that I don't think very many people have. And we also can see at the top, the very top, we have this nice little title. I think that's really nice. But I do want to talk about something and it is that this server has way too many mods on it. There is way too much going on. Press F1, we get this nice little animation on it that we definitely don't need, but whatever, I guess we'll take it. I'll take it, I'll take it. So yeah, there are just way too many mods on this. Like this, you can't move your camera at all, otherwise it'll like freak out. We have this little nice little guide down here telling me and then we have like if we press enter we have this stuff like i feel like they overdid it we have in the top right it says galaxite i don't know why it says galaxite but there's that i haven't played this in a while so like don't get mad at me if i do that we have blocks that's five i guess but honestly i don't really have any problems with their games but i'm going to be talking about some things they need to do better why why why, why did i why did i just take damage oh okay yeah, since there's not a lot of players on, it does take longer for the lobbies to fill up, which is kind of irritating because I do want to, like, log on to the games as fast as I do in the hive. Right? Another thing I want to talk about is, like, how everybody on here is, like, five years old. Um, I don't really care if you're five years old, but you play the game, but, like, this isn't... I don't feel like this is a really good PvP experience, and you're gonna see a lot of players doing that if you keep watching. So yeah, the thing that I love about the server is that they are so original and they have all these great ideas, but I don't feel like they are very good at getting them out there or like executing them, if you get what I mean. See, like, I just walked past that kid. Like, I completely just stopped in my tracks and I just, he's trying to punch his own core, okay. And then we can just like punch this kid. He's like, yeah. I feel like everyone here is on mobile. He's, oh, what the? He's like, did you, did you see that? <laughs> oh yeah, something else that's great about the server. I don't think I've ever seen a hacker on Galaxite because like they might actually have like decent anti-cheat compared to the hive. The armor is super weird. It's not like actual armor. It's like this, uh, like I, I don't, I don't hate it. I think it's, I think it's a cool idea. Um, but like sometimes you might need to just like go with what everyone else is used to see like this kid is also not very good at pvp so yeah um yeah they could probably make like a <clears throat> certain oh did i win i won okay they could probably oh <laughs> They can make um different device queuing they might do that but they just don't have enough players like on the hive you need 200 players of a certain device to be able to actually do the device queuing i don't know how to explain it. they might have level queuing i haven't played enough to like see if they do have that i really do love the style of this they keep that like futuristic vibe going on they have like um throughout the whole server throughout their whole like maps and stuff and all of their games you can just see the theme of galaxi just like everywhere and i absolutely love it but sadly i don't think enough people play the server for them to actually like sustain like um like enough money to keep their server running you know because 
it does cost several thousand dollars for these featured servers to, you know, like stay up here because you might not think about it. It's just like running it on your computer, but you have to think about all the stuff you have to buy for your computer. You have to pay the electricity bills, and the Wi-Fi, all that stuff. Um, can I can I buy stuff with these? Oh, over here. Yeah. So yeah, that is probably gonna do it for this video. I think that Galaxite has a lot of potential, but there are some things that they need to improve on the server that I've already talked about. So uh, yeah, thanks for watching. I will see you in the next one.